is named Dub TV Production. Hello, is this is Wiki. Ah, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Everybody, welcome back to Sleep Dub TV. I'm Jim Charon, hosting instead of Mr. Snoop Dub today, so yeah, so welcome back to episode 3 of the Isle of Armor again. Um, the gameplay video for the new Pokemon. I think we're gonna get back on Twitter. Remember to like and subscribe, and um, we'll get into the video. Bye bye. Well, thank you, Masterful Snoop Dub. So we're going to go straight back to where we left off in the last episode as we go and find the magical mushrooms. I know, it, it sounds pretty dodgy because I mean, mushrooms you kind of think of some naughty little things, but you know, we're getting some magic mushrooms to make some soup hopefully, or some food. We'll see how we go anyway. I actually have not made a video like this for quite some time so I apologise, I'll try to get them pushed out. I've been doing quite a lot of streaming of late so... That's been keeping me busy and then translating those into an edited file, which is always uh, quite the enjoyment. But, uh, yeah, if you want to catch me on Twitch, um, Snipdub TV, hopefully I might do a couple of Pokemon there as well. We'll see how we go, got plenty of games and action coming up. And yeah. Also, hope that you guys love the beautiful intro in this episode. I know, um, I go a bit a little crazy at the starts of um, episodes and stuff like that, but hey, why not? I mean, the kids are very entertaining, kind of keep the positive vibe going, so that's all that matters at the end of the day. So we're going to try to catch this scolipede. I, like, to be honest, I don't know why Scolipede's decided to go and, you know, get the speed going. I'm a bit confused about that. I think that he'd be pretty, a lot, well, a lot faster than Snorlax anyway, because Snorlax is one of the slower Pokemon out there. Unless, like, our little Kali Classic Bulbasaur is getting those little levels up, which is absolutely majestical. Because we want to go and see that beautiful evolution and Dynamax, or is it Geomax? I think it's, oh wait, Gigantamax! I'm a little bit hyper today, I just, I had one coffee, so it's not a crazy amount of coffee, but nevertheless, it's, it's, it does some damage. Of course, that's some orange juice too. Just going to try not to make Bulbasaur learn too many moves, simply because then we can go and add them on later on, because that's probably better way to do it because then we can get some more powerful moves and look we have our Bulbasaur evolving here we go guys all right we have an Ivasaur that is terrific we just got one more evolution to go until it's a Beansaur which is absolutely wonderful I must say I always love the sound effect of when a Pokemon evolves I don't know why it's just you know it's a, it's some bopping music going Alright, so I think that's some um, magic mushrooms there. I think we'd better go and pick them up. Okay, here comes trouble. You went stealing my magic mushrooms. Ha, uh, just as I expected, multiple max mushrooms. Jeez. So rude. Alright, looks like we have to go back into battle again, which is always just, it's a bit of a breeze getting um, past because it's just to get the slope cut down now. Oh, my Snorlax. And yes, we will see which one is truly superior. Going to use a bit of crunch, super effective. Slowpoke got his confusion off first just before me, which is a bit of a bummer, but that's okay. We'll get this one in the one shot, hopefully. Oh. It's very cheap. Right, we'll go and knock it out with one more crunch.
getting that Kelly Classic leveling up just nicely. Got to dab her now. I believe the first time we battled this chainer, I believe it was just as slow as we had to beat. See, I wouldn't mind getting an Abra and Kadabra myself actually, because I love the evolution, which is the Alexan. I think that's what the name is. So I think I'm um, gonna go and trade it though to be able to fully evolve it, which is shit. I've got you know, the other version of Pokemon, but this is just the, my version. Got the Kadabra knocked out. Got those Kali Classic levels going up again. So a little bit later, but we'll go way back now. Love a little woo bat. Used to always have that Pokemon quite often actually when I used to play Pokemon Black and White and Black and White 2. Quite often tried to fully evolve into Woo Bat and Woo Bat was pretty good when I used to play with it, so. I might go and catch the words later as well, we'll go and catch as many Pokemon from this new DLC as much as possible. And we'll also do the same for when the other DLC comes out later in the year. I don't exactly remember when, but it's in a couple months. Yeah, go get your rain back to my shoes. Pookie phone's gone. Hello, hello, it's Martin's phone. How's the child coming along, love? You mean you've already managed to get the magic mushrooms? I've been checking in every progress. This is going too fast. This text. I just want to get through because I want to go and see the Pookie Ninja Master. Gonna go and explore a bit more of this little tunnel area and see where it goes to. Oh, there's a little item. I'm gonna quickly go and get that one. I think it's a move. Got Stealth Rock, that's always a handy move. We've got a Chansey. The evolution of this, I'm pretty sure, isn't it? I'm not sure how you get to it. Maybe I can go catch it. I also have plans to play a couple of the new Pokemon games that are coming out. There's a couple like little mini games coming out, not part of the main trilogy or whatever. You kind of classify these mainstream games, but there's like Pokemon Cafe. There's a couple little ones as well, I don't exactly remember all the names, but I will go and play those when I can. There's more coming out every couple of days, so... Well, wait, maybe not. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'll go and play those. I think Cafe Mix is the one I'm going to play soon, so I'll go and check that one out. I don't have high expectations of it, so it's not a mainstream game, but hey, you never know. Always gotta give things a chance, I reckon. Here we go, our Ivy Saw is evolving. Should I say Kelly Classic? Got that beautiful little evolution music, and we now officially have a Venusaur! Pedal Blizzard, okay, I'll give that one. Ooh, let's 
sand shoe on the ground there. I'll have to bump into those if I don't exactly want one. <laughs> Wet hot bottom desert. Quite an interesting name, I reckon. I got one of those Pokemon before, so I don't think I'm gonna go and battle it. Oh, we've got a little sand dial. I love sand dial, that was pretty good back in the Unova region back in the day. She's going to upgrade my Pokédex in Trees of Sun. Oh, she's adding a Pokémon. Fletchling! I used to play that quite often, that Pokémon in the TCG when I used to play that. Yeah, I used to do like tournaments and stuff because I kind of really enjoy Pokémon cards. I mean, I still do, but it can get expensive, you know, every now and then. Yeah, it just came a little bit too much for me and at the moment I have other things I kind of want to spend my money on. So it looks like at this stage we're only able to go to specific parts of the map to be able to fly to, which is a bit annoying. That should be one on the other side of the map, but that's okay. Well, I don't know, I say, sorry. But nevertheless, we are going to go and drop off our magic mushrooms. In we go. Oh, oh, it doesn't look like they quite were able to go and find their max mushrooms. I think you missed a mustard. Sorry, I probably called them magic mushrooms earlier, I apologise for that. I think that was the same with the express charm, I certainly called it the express share a couple weeks ago when I uploaded the other video. Oh, it looks like we're making a magic potion. Or should I say, a max potion. Really? You really have to come in? Got the max mushroom, I see. Well, I got it first, so I sincerely apologize because I'm just too good. Yeah, I don't want my thunder stolen. I protest. This is not fair. Oh, this is looking very mysterious. Here we go, here we go, here's the max soup. Let's eat. I mean, I wouldn't really encourage you guys to be eating mushrooms at home unless it's, you know, been approved to be safe, but hey, not all mushrooms are good and all, not all mushrooms are bad. Ooh, it's special if Pokemon drink the soup.
Thanks to Sue, Miss Honey. Sorry, I'm putting all these weird accents on today. So it looks like we're meeting... Ah. It's a big little creature. The robot. Let's see what Mustard has to say to us. Here comes the third trial. Yes, we get a Pokemon battle with Dynamax. Then you can get the secret armor. Kind of getting excited. I will certainly die most of my heart content to beat this little Avery. Jeez, someone's in a hurry. <laughs> yeah, I know. Bit of a slacker. Alright, let's go to the battlefield. Doha Mustard secretly playing some Nintendo Switch, I reckon. Just to go and quickly heal my Pokemon so we're all ready to go for the battle. Quite a nice little setting we've got here. It's just about time we got this battle underway. Take my place and let's get going. I must say, the mustard was pretty quick for an old man to be able to get there pretty quickly. I am most certainly ready. Good about a very is fit. The music for the Pokemon battle is actually not too bad. I will admit that. And looks like we still have Pokemon turn into heart. Can use my little Snorlax. Actually, I didn't really call it a little actually. I think it's called like Big Man, Big Snorlax. Super effective, and that knocked him out in one hit. Continuing to raise those Cali Classic levels. Pokedabra coming our way. Gonna keep Pokemon in, I reckon. Simply 
right there. Sweet bat coming next. Love a little bit of sweet bat. Used to always use sweet bat and I used to always use the trap. And yeah, that just no Pokemon could handle it. So if we got screwed about it in one hit, as expected, I would say. Got a slow bro. Go and we'll switch it up. I don't exactly know why, but I just feel like doing it. Get a mile to action. Pocket money. And I just completed the very last trial, which was the third trial, which is absolutely excellent. I mean, personally, I kind of expected it, but it's always good to get a little bit of a victory every now and then. I should be sorry. I get the secret armor of 
armor or something like that. I'll have to see what it is in a minute. See what it is. Oh, it's cute. That's cool. Of. Must be the red hair. Cub food. Welcome to the Brotherhood Cub 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 food. I need more coffee, guys. I guess that's the excuse for everything. I don't think Hub Fu looks very happy. A small Pokemon, but that's all right. Mm, should give it a nickname. Yeah, why not? I go the the Western Thick Burger. No, can't be bothered. <laughs> well, we respect Cup Food's name. I keep naturally saying Kung Fu, it's supposed to be Kung Fu. I mean, I, they probably did the name on purpose, so... Knowing them. It's gonna be like Pokemon Soul Silver and Heart Gold. That was when you were able to have the Pokemon out of your Pokeball and like walking with you. Which is a feature that I thought they should have brought back a little while ago, but it looks like it becomes a reality in this little DLC. So guys, thank you for watching Stay Chin. We're gonna go back to Snoop Dub in the studio. So that comes to an end to another Snoop Dub production. I'm Ginger, and I hope that you enjoyed the video. Remember to like and subscribe, and we will see you soon for some more quality content here on Snoop Dog TV. See you guys. Wee hee hee.